This is graduation day. The 2021 class is here, ready to go. It's been a long time with COVID-19 and we missed last year because of it and all the lockdowns and now we're back. And this is gonna be great today to see them achieve such a wonderful dream that they have in their heart and to see that they're gonna go on to residency and they're going to treat hundreds of thousands of people over their lifetime. That's an extension of what we've accomplished here and we're very proud of that. Honestly, it's, I still don't believe it. So I think uh, it'll finally hit me when I walk across that stage, but it's crazy that it's been such a long ride and we're here. It's been a lot of late nights, a lot of studying hard for the boards and going off to rotation and lived overseas for two years. So it's definitely a great accomplishment. It's an incredible feeling, I think. For me, especially because I came, I transferred from a different school that wouldn't allow me the chance to actually go across. And Trinity took a chance on me and then really like helped nurture me through this. And it, there's a lot of hurdles, but as you can see, walking across that stage with an MD this day. So I'm extraordinarily excited to be here. To walk across the stage today means everything. It's a symbol of a journey of a lot of hard work, the support of my family, my friends, my loved ones, the amazing connections that I made on the island and in Baltimore. This is the best day of my life to date, so I'm excited to start my journey as a physician and make Trinity proud. Graduates, I want to personally thank each of you for being a part of our Trinity family. You are a source of pride for all of us and we will follow your career with great anticipation. You are an inspiration for us to continue to improve all facets of our medical education program. And through you, we are living our dream of making a difference through medical education. Thank you all for being here today. Well, fortunately, I lost my mom and my dad within the journey of like, trying to complete medical school. So this means a lot to me. So, and Trinity has been quite a family to me. As you can see, this is a welcoming school. They, they, have the, they have this family culture where everyone is willing to help. I'm super proud of him. I'm representing the whole family here. We've come a long way, all the way from Africa, Ghana, and he made us proud, super proud of him. To me, it's, it's a new chapter in my life. This is very exciting, you know. Uh, I was born in Thailand and, you know, I had a humble beginning. I used to sell like steamed dumpling on the street before. So coming to this point, it's, a, it's, it's in my wildest dream. So I'm so happy to be here. Unbelievable. He's my heart. This afternoon, we celebrate 73 graduates who have completed many years of rigorous study and earned the Doctor of Medicine degree. By the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees and President Wilson of the Trinity School of Medicine, I do hereby confer upon each of you the degree Doctor of Medicine. It's exciting. I think in the moment, you're, all you're thinking about is just getting that diploma and not falling and getting off of there. <laughs> She's amazing. She's amazing. She did it all on her own. And uh, I was just a support system. We were just a support system. I'm kind of the classic story. You know, applying for one year to U.S. schools, don't get in. You know, so you look elsewhere, and this was a, a great option, I thought. He's just so amazing, so amazing, so proud of him. Likewise. <laughs> Trinity was a great choice for me. Um, I'm a non-traditional student, so I didn't feel like I was coming in and being with a bunch of young kids. There were a lot of adults there, and it really made it feel like home, and the class sizes were great. The faculty was amazing. My classmates were great. Uh, I had been told before coming to a Caribbean school that it was going to be absolutely cutthroat and you know your classmates were going to stab you in the back and Trinity was not like that at all. Will the new doctors of medicine please stand? I make these promises solemnly, freely, and upon my honor. Welcome doctors. This is Dr. Dr. Athena Tidino. We met on the island. She is a graduate. She's currently PGY3 in Philadelphia. She's OB, and I'm very proud of her, and couldn't have done anything without her. So honored to be able to put her, and we couldn't have done this without each other, so so proud. Yeah. Unbelievably hard work. Let's just say I couldn't stop shaking. It was, it was a very, very honorable moment. Very, 
touching. I am uh, so proud of my son who uh, overcame a lot of obstacles and challenges to make it to this milestone today. It's, it's incredibly significant. Uh, I couldn't be more happy for him and, and proud of what he's accomplished. I am so proud. This guy has been a role model for me my whole life and he's He's held me up every step of the way, whatever decision I've made, whether I wanted to be a snowboard instructor for a couple <laughs> years or whether I wanted to go to med school, he's always been there for me. Love you, Daddy-O. I could love you any more than today. Wow. It's great. Yeah. Great day. It's a long time coming, and uh, I guess it didn't really hit me until I actually got the diploma, and then it all just sunk in all at once, so it was a great feeling. I feel like Trinity definitely was a partner in me getting to where I need to be. I made the right choice. I was asked earlier what was my thought about commencement day, and I said it's bittersweet because although we're, we love you, we have to push you out of the nest, but the great thing is we know how high you'll fly. Let it begin. Woo! You can feel it coming like a flood. Wash over us, wash over us. No more waiting, we're taking the chance. This could change everything. Woo! Come on, put it up like this. Let it begin. Oh, let it begin. Let, 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 let it begin. Let the future begin. Congratulations.